Well, I can tell you, I am delighted to be out at Margie's Farm and Garden here, and I'm with Margie and her entire family right now. <laughs> so, you know, Margie, so long ago, we started with, with strawberry recipes, and we did this wonderful pie years ago, and it's became a really popular segment still on the show. Then last year, you introduced taking strawberries and making a daiquiri, which means you can freeze strawberries and use them for daiquiris year-round easily. Oh yes, great use for strawberries year-round. So tell me, what are we doing with this recipe? Today we are making strawberry ice cream. Ooh. Homemade strawberry ice cream, easy enough for even you, William, or the kids to make. <laughs> well, you know, I have to say, I know there's no ice cream maker. No, so no, it's done all without an ice cream maker, just with stuff you have at home. Wow. Easy to do. And is this is this wonderful beauty here going to be telling us how? how Emily do we mix is it together? Emily here is going to be demonstrating and showing us how to do it. Wonderful. Take yep. a, take over, Emily. Okay, so we're gonna start by getting our plastic bags. Okay. And uh, I'm gonna open. hold this open for just you, a, right? A quart size Ziploc bag. Yes. Uh, and then we have one cup half and half. We're gonna just dump right in there. One cup half and half. Yes. Then we're gonna do uh, so we're going to do our sugar, actually, which is two tablespoons oh, of sugar. Oh, that's not much at all. Yes, not much at all. Uh, then we're going to do our one teaspoon vanilla extract. Okay. And then our strawberries, which we're doing half a cup of smashed strawberries. And so, it, yeah, I was going to say, it looks like you smashed them up or Yes, something. and then we strain them a little bit so that it doesn't get too liquidy. Okay. So when we actually, when they actually freeze. Wow. And we're gonna uh, close that up and try to get the air out of the bag. The air out. Boy, you're you're taking a risk on me, aren't you? Okay, yeah. so I'll squish it down a little bit and then pull this across. All right. Perfect. All right. So you can shake that up a little bit. Just mix, to mix it, it up. Yeah. Mix, mix all the ingredients. Okay. All right. Now. And we're gonna put it in our ice right here. We have a ice with uh, two uh, Ziploc. And why is there bags. two? Just in case if we if it breaks or uh, if something cracks or yeah. well, okay. Just so in set case. that in there and then what else? Then we're going to do our half cup of rock salt just on top. Just, just pour it right in. It. Okay, just like you would make ice cream in a machine. Yes. With the, okay, and then just I like sealed that. this first one up, and I got the crew here waiting to shake it. So I'm I'm going to make sure that I get it right, and then whoops, I didn't get that one right. All right. Then I seal up the other one. And then what is the process then after we seal them up? Then we just shake it for about five minutes or that's until all. it's frozen. Yeah, that's all that's you do all. is shake and shake and shake. So I've got this sealed up now. God willing, I've done it right. And then I'm gonna hand it over to the automation of shaking. Here you go, shake away. Okay, now, whew, I am tired from shaking all that. So here you go. Now, now, what what are we doing with it now? Uh, we're taking it out of the bags and just wiping it down a little bit. Oh, it's already it's already firming up. Yes, we're just gonna wipe it down because it had some salt water on it. And then after you wipe it down, it's it's literally ready to eat, right, yes. Emily? Yes. Already. So for this, we're gonna just cut a hole in the corner. You make it a server. That's how you serve it now. Yes. <laughs> then you can take a bowl. You can just squeeze it out. Wow. Like in the last batch. <laughs> right. Look at that. Doesn't that look delicious? And that, that is amazing. Wow, and then are you going to put a strawberry on it? Yes. <laughs> Look at that. Wonderful. Now, do, do I get to actually taste it? Yes. Oh, of course. Yeah. Here's your spoon. And so while I'm tasting this, tell me, oh, these are hood strawberries, right? So these are hood strawberries. We're in the middle of picking our hood strawberries, which are definitely a favorite among customers. And then about how much longer time do you have for strawberries? We have about days? two more weeks of strawberries. So we have them already picked here, or there's also you pick if you feel ex excited about coming and picking your own. I had to take a taste. I had to take a taste of a number two because it is absolutely really good. Isn't it fantastic it for is. like and five minutes just, of work? Right. Yeah. For just, well, if you have four kids, it's five minutes of work. For me, it'd be thirty minutes of work. But absolutely delicious. Well, you know, every every time we come out here, it's fun because 
we always promote the plants, but then we love to promote what you can do with the wonderful produce you can get here as well. So for more information on this recipe or any of the recipes, go to gardentime.tv. We'll click you over to their website and you can bring it all up. Thank you, Margie. Thank you, kids. Appreciate it. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs>